Good morning everyone and this is another day in my chauffeur life. Today I'm having a family of six and I'll be taking them for sightseeing here in Sydney. They are currently staying in a hotel in Sydney which I'm gonna be heading right now to that hotel. Are you ready? Let's go! My name is Ratko, a Sydney based chauffeur aka Ray. On this channel I share my passion by giving you a glimpse into my chauffeur life. Macquarie Street, not far from the Sydney Opera House. Actually, the Sydney Opera House is a couple hundred meters on that way. And this hotel is uh, very, very in a convenient location for the simple reason because it's uh, on the main road that has uh, an access to the freeway which takes you back to the airport. And on the other side, you have the Opera House, one of the most famous landmarks in Sydney. So today I am in my seven seater, which is uh, the black Mercedes, and picking up people for sightseeing. Sightseeing, obviously, it's an activity. We'll be taking the people to a new places so they can check all these cool features that one attraction or landmark might have. They should be out anytime soon. So the booking is for 12 o'clock. It's currently 11:45, and uh, we'll see how this sightseeing will look like today. In this instance is a family of six people that just came from abroad they've never been to australia before and i'm gonna make sure i'm gonna leave a first very good first impression because i'm a firm believer as soon as you arrive to a foreign country the first impression you get for the for that country is the grand transportation which means the chauffeurs or the taxi drivers so that's why i want to make sure i'm gonna leave the first very very good impression and once i get to the hotel the first thing that i normally do i go to the reception introduce myself and tell them why well, I'm here. Hi, Good afternoon, how are you? Yes, I'm good, thank you. What's the, what's the number again? <laughs> Let me double check. Yeah. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. No yes. Yeah, that's fine. Is the black car is yours? That's the one. Yeah, yeah no problem. Thank you so much. Yeah. Do you mind if I ask you, um, do you, do you have an itinerary about my movements today with these people? Yeah, so I'll just add uh, that e email. So, uh, Thank you. If you want to print that yeah. email, yeah, that's fine. Thank you so much. So you've got the whole day with them? A few, hours. few hours, yeah. yeah. Once I tell them who I am, they're going to provide the itinerary, which is the predetermined plan, the exact plan of our movements for the day. The receptionist advised the client that the chauffeur is waiting for them and they came down quickly. The first place that we visited that was Darling Harbour. The place that you can see behind me, it's the iconic Sydney place Darling Harbour. So this is our first stop for today, for the sightseeing that I'm having with this family of six. When people um, never been to Sydney before, my main concern is the communication or, or the language. Luckily, they speak perfect English. So this is one of the places uh, that we're going to be seeing today. Actually, they are in the main site on the other side of the Downey Harbour, which I don't have access with my, with my vehicle. Um, I just walked uh, through here so I can show you what this place looks like. It's one of the most beautiful one of my favorite places here in Sydney and then on the other side which is the, on my left hand side that's uh, the new um, area in Sydney it's called Barangaroo the boat right next to me it's a replica from all these uh, uh, old boats uh, a couple of hundred years ago and it's a really really nice attraction for 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 the people there's another taxi coming and uh, one of the most uh, visited sites uh, here in Sydney which includes a lot of restaurants a lot of uh, coffee shops and also maritime museum uh, which is not far from where I'm standing now so ladies and gentlemen Downey Harbour Sydney
when I'm having a sightseeing day like this today, um, usually we do exchange numbers with the with the clients uh, in case they can't see me or they can't find me uh, when they finish uh, touring uh, Dali Harbour or any other place. So once we exchange the numbers, numbers on WhatsApp or Viber or any other similar um, app, then obviously it's gonna make the things easier for them. As soon as they're done, they can text me or I'm gonna go around all the way back there, pick them up and off to the next location. Obviously, we're going to be visiting uh, multiple locations. We are, as soon as they're done with Downing Harbour, we're going to be going in Barangaroo, then over the bridge, North Sydney. As soon as we are done in North Sydney, we're going to be taking them to another place in uh, in eastern part of the city. And uh, that includes a few places like Watson's Bay, uh, Rose Bay, uh, Vaucluse. Then we're going to be visiting the most iconic Sydney, Bondi Beach. As soon as we are done with Bondi Beach, then I'm taking uh, the people to, to a restaurant for, for day lunch. As soon as they are done with the lunch, then we are off back to the hotel. I've been waiting at this place in uh, not far from Dali Harbour, which is um, practically in, in Piemont, um, two minutes from the from the from the place where I've dropped them off, and I've been lucky because I found this. Um, shade for, for, for the car, otherwise I have to be um, staying on the sun for all day long. They've they never been here before and this is one of the great days in their lives. Sydney Harbour Bridge that connects the central Sydney and also the northern part of the city had a huge vision back in the 30s uh, and all that because of that eight lanes that we have today. <laughs> and look what I found here, Australian Army. It's attraction for all these people that are coming here at this iconic Sydney place. I'm always amazed about things like this. Okay, you can take photos here. Yeah. 
I take to this place almost every single client that has never been to Sydney before. It's, uh, it's a perfect location for taking uh, photos, to take a selfie. Almost all my clients that I'm taking for, for sightseeing uh, here in Sydney, this is one of the places that I cannot avoid and every client has to see it. So pretty much we are in the northern part of the city. And actually I'm surprised that I found a parking spot so I can wait for the, the clients to, to finish with their touring because it's Sunday today. It's been pretty much busy. It's a really, really nice day today. Especially um, uh, everyone is out, especially after all these days with, uh, with rain. We had so much of rain in Sydney for the last uh, few months. And it's uh, it's, uh, it's a lovely here on the other side of the CBD, the Central Business District. So I think it's better for me to go in the car Ooh. and wait for the telephone call because any any minute they can call me, so I can go pick them up, and we are off to the next location. So after spending one hour in Darling Harbour and one in Kiribili, the client asked me if I can recommend a good place for them to have their lunch. And I definitely recommended Watson's Bay. Watson's Bay is uh, it's an amazing place, one of my favourites here in Sydney. But uh, before we got to Watson's Bay, we also stopped in Double Bay and Rose Bay for coffee and take a quick selfie. So by the time they finish their lunch, I'm gonna quickly check if, if the vehicle is clean and probably I'm gonna go and find a shop so I can have some lunch too. How much for the bill? Can I have a one drink as well? Um, Diet Coke, please. Actually, I've only got Pepsi Max. Right? That's fine, that's fine. Yep. <laughs> Thank you. After Watson's Bay, it was unavoidable for me to take him to Bondi Beach, but I couldn't film anything in Bondi Beach for the simple reason because we just drove past and we did not stop. That's it for today. Hopefully you did like the video. If you did like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, give me a thumbs down. And I'll see you in the next video of my show for life.